Hi. Hi. Hey guys. So today we have some classic Star Trek products to show you. Thank you so much to Playmates Toys for sending us these free products. Thank, Thank you. you. So we have three of the classic Star Trek movie series figures. We have James T. Kirk, Khan Noonland Singh, and Captain Spock. And then we have the classic Star Trek classic phaser. So we're going to start with the figures. We're going to get them out of the box and give you a closer look. So first we have Admiral James T. Kirk. Hello. So he comes with numerous accessories. We've got the Starfleet wrist communicator, which allows Admiral Kirk to stay in consistent contact with the Enterprise while conducting away missions. Then we have the captain's log which is a portable electronic device for recording personal log entries during Starfleet missions. I'm assuming it's this? Yes. Okay. Then we have the Type 2 Phaser. With various power settings, this versatile handheld weapon will disrupt or destroy the molecular energy in any target. <laughs> it no work. <laughs> And then, of course, we have the Starfleet Action Base, where we can stand him up or plug him into the base. Khan is always ready for action. Wiggly. Very cool. Great detail on the figure. And They're very poseable. Yes, they are. Very <laughs> poseable. <laughs> Love that. Next, we have Khan Noonien Singh. Hello. Very nice. These figures are awesome. Look how flexible. He, he really be moving. So the accessories that he comes with include the Starfleet phaser, the standard weapon issued by Starfleet. The phaser is capable of generating immense energy waves to annihilate a target. We have the bowl of seti eels. Seti eels grow inside humanoid brains and inhibit with power, which lets Khan control his victims. You might as well eat this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Next, we have the Genesis control box. Stolen by Khan, this is used to target and detonate the Genesis device. Cool. Here, take this. <laughs> and he also comes with a Starfleet action base. Very nice. And now we have Captain Spock. The engineering tool allows Spock to handle practically any breakdown that might occur on the Enterprise. The Starfleet Tricorder is a standard data processing device for all away missions. The Tricorder quickly analyzes field data and stores it for later study. And he also has gloves. Yes, the radiation gloves, which provide radiation protection to the hands when in the warp core chamber. And there you can see his hand without the glove on it. And, of course, he comes with a Starfleet action base as well. Look at them posing. Whoa. So flexible. I don't know this one. It's Pilates time. We need to stretch, you know. These have great detail, and I love that they are so flexible. It's very flexible. Look, he's ice skating. Whee. And I love that they come with the stands as well. Perfect for collectors if you want to display them. They're so flexible. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he's twisted. Yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> These two are trying to ice skate apparently because Oh, oh god. <laughs> Next, we're going to show you a closer look at the classic phaser. So this is the classic phaser Starfleet standard issue sidearm. The classic phaser configuration consists of a type 1 phaser interlocked with a type 2 phaser body. The two phasers combine to create a powerful defensive weapon with minimal phase degradation. Designed around the Federation's policy of creating weapons for defensive purposes, the classic phaser is a prime example of early Starfleet innovation. This classic phaser's simple yet highly effective design made it one of the most reliable weapons of its time. Highly powerful with adjustable settings, the classic phaser was the paradigm for early portable defensive sidearms. So it has a light-up beam emitter, a phaser power switch, and phaser setting dial. 
You press the trigger for light up beam and firing sound. And you adjust the phaser setting dial to vary firing sound. And to note, parents, all of these products are recommended for ages four and up. This is so cool because it has the actual lights and sounds from the original Star Trek TV show. <laughs> This phaser is really cool. It's fun for a role play item or even just a collector, right? Cool yes. to display. Because it stands up on its own. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you again to Playmates Toys for sending us these three products. Thank, Thank you. you. Test and then guys, bye. bye.